Okay, so I'm just going to go over the UFX trade management. This is just a quick tutorial uh, to show how to set up the trades uh, and how your lot size is automatically adjusted. So um, the reason for this tool, after you drag onto your chart, you're going to be uh, shown the input window here. It's only got uh, one setting that you're going to want to change. Um, which is based on your risk. Are you wanting to risk 1%, 2%, or 5% of your account equity? So obviously 1% is conservative, 2% is moderate, 5% is aggressive. Uh, we're gonna sit, stick at the default for risking 1%. Um, now the reason for this tool is so that people aren't over leveraging their account, um, so that if they do have a bad week or a bad two weeks, um, you're not gonna blow through your account because I know people do like to over leverage and uh, think they can take a small amount of money and turn it into a large amount of money very quickly but if they're hitting a bad week or two they're not going to survive um, when the good trades do come so anyways uh, let's get into the details here we're gonna hit OK and you're gonna see that it now uh, has a little box here on your charts and the first step is simply setting the stop loss um, so we're gonna go over the uh, selling at market and doing a limit order so uh, those are the only two, two types of orders on this box here obviously your big button is your sell you're gonna sell at market using this button and you're gonna buy at market using this button uh, they're grayed out so they don't do anything right now um, and as we go through the steps you're gonna see the different things light up so we're gonna set our stop loss first and you can see that a horizontal line appears on the chart. This is your stop loss. You hover over it, you can see the SL. We're gonna to wanna to drag this to where we want our stop loss. If we try to set our lot size, lot size right now, we're gonna be given a warning message. It needs to be moved. So, okay, we do need to set it. Let's just move this up and we're gonna go for a sell at market. Um, so let's set our lot size. We've been uh, adjusted to 0.05. Okay, are we setting a limit order? Now, we're asked this question because if we're setting a limit order, then the limit order button is gonna highlight. Um, if we hit no, then our um, sell button is gonna highlight based on selling at market. So, okay, so obviously we're not gonna set a limit order on this one. We're gonna sell at market. So click no. Now you can see that the sell button is highlighted. All we're gonna do is click sell and the trade's been placed okay our stop loss is up high and um, we're in the trade now at market um, and that's it for that so let's get out of this trade here and set up the limit order okay so we're gonna do a sell limit order now same thing we're gonna risk 1% hit okay and just walk through the steps again set the stop loss our stop loss line is appears on the chart we're gonna move that up and set our lot size now we do want to set a limit order okay now you can see that a green horizontal line has showed up on the chart all we're gonna do is drag this up to where we want our limit order to be set um, so let's just put it up over into this area where the big drop occurred little bit of a support spot that we bounced off of broke through so if we come up here we're going to sell so let's place the sell limit order and you can see everything is done here now for you lot size was automatically adjusted uh, based on the equity of the account so okay now we can close this out and we're gonna go over the buys okay so I've just switched down here from uh, euro USD to the USD CAD um, and let's go over taking a buy at market and taking a um, buy limit order we're gonna risk a little bit uh, higher here we're gonna do five percent and you can see up in the top bar here that the risk is set to five percent it's an aggressive um, risk percentage same thing set our stop loss now we're looking for a buy and a buy um, limit order on this now so we're gonna set our stop right down below here and now based on the distance we we're gonna risk uh, 0.34 
um, that's going to be 5% of our account based on where our stop is here. So let's do uh, a buy up market. <clears throat> Are you setting a limit order? No, we're going to do a market order and our buy now lights up and we're just going to click the button and you can see we bought at market and we've got our stop in place here. So, okay, so we'll close this out. And now we're going to go over the buy limit. The same thing, we'll risk uh, 5%. Always starting with the uh, setting the stop loss. We'll set this up. Put it back under the swing here. Set our lot size. 0.34, are you setting a limit order? Yes. Now you can see that the place of buy limit order has been highlighted. It's green and our green horizontal line has been um, set up for us and ready to uh, be set where we want to take the trade. So say we're going to come down into this area here and we're going to place our buy limit. Now you can see that the trade is set up and that is it. That's how uh, the management tool works. Uh, I hope you guys find it useful and handy and uh, this way you're not over leveraging. Uh, we will talk to you later.